Hello, y'all. Uh, I would rather wait tomorrow, but I want to get it over with now. Anyways, it's your girl, Baby Black Kitty, with you with another Dragon Roger video. And uh, I just hit level 100 like a half an hour ago. Honestly, I was supposed to hit level 100 by the end of tomorrow, but apparently I was able to use the missing memories thingies. And I used like five of them, maybe? So I was able to- I was really close anyway. So I was just like, you know what, let me just do it. I want to hit level 100 now. So yes, your girl is level 100! Let's go! <laughs> She looking cute in her dance of castle. <laughs> Isn't that amazing though? Oh, it took so long though. Also, apologize for any inconvenience once again. You know my phone ain't the best. <laughs> my mom said she was gonna give me an iPhone, but I don't know how long. But anyways, we're gonna do the story just to get it over with. Premium Cuban cigars and vintage wine. You have my permission to enjoy them with me. Oh, I'm only a, a reaper for the time being because it's hard to keep up with the ratings right now. Uh, but anyways, um, let me just, uh, raise my graphics a little bit so we can see how good this looks. So let's let's do it. Let's see what's going on. Hope my thing isn't too loud. Hope y'all can hear me. Let me turn it down a little bit. But yeah, in the last episode, we uh we ended up figuring out um what Anjo's purpose was for seeking uh, for seeking revenge on the dragon lords. And the, the, you know, the monsters, you know. Apparently he, uh, apparently he lost family and friends. And now it's, now he's seeking vengeance until the day he dies, you know. Uh, of course, now monsters are heading away to Tokyo, so it's up to us to protect everyone. Okay, so... The Warden Army will arrive in ten minutes. There should be some supplies on the artificial island that can still be used. Please make preparations. Okay. 10,000 wardens? Oh, I need to make a phone call. Are you at the airport? I said I wanted to tell you something after we safely left Japan. I think I'm either telling you now or never. According to our intel, you might have two sons. Hold on. You heard me. You have two sons, and they are right here in Tokyo. And you don't know each other at all. Alright. Okay. I should have raised that. It is not 100% confirmed, but there is a very good chance. The signal went out. It seems the communication network in Tokyo is also gone. Were you calling Master Uesugi just now? Well, at least he is notified. In case the boys are eaten by the warden armies. And that would be a great shame. Ha 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 ha! Lock and load! Mm. Ooh. Alright, trial runs. Oh, yes, as you can see, there's my baby girl. Wait, what? Jesus, I'm so short if I'm reaching up like that. I'm so short, that's not even funny. Oh, oh, should I hit this thing instead? No, that's cool. 
doesn't like characters. She's so small to the point where she has to do that. Oh. Well, damn. This don't look cool. Okay, now I'm done. <laughs> I'm so small. This is not even funny, bruh. And I asked Molly for six extra dollars just to get get my character the smallest possible, and I still haven't achieved it. But I've seen someone for cross server that's smaller than me. I give up, all right. I still need my thickness. I ain't about to go skinny just to look small. This farm looks in good shape. Planktion Island is a man-made floating island used to connect to Tokyo Bay Trans Sea Expressway. This is the last base on Tokyo Bay, so as soon as the warnings make it past the island, there is nothing standing in the way from there. Everyone currently in Plankton Island are the last hope of Tokyo. Alright. Preparations are complete. Caesar, I've heard the Gattusos can produce burning blood. So... Don't be stingy when we need it. I only have two shots left. It might be a different story if I had 200. But you still want to try it, Mr. Andrew? Are you joking? I am the principal of Castle College. If I can't stop the swarming wardens, just who can? Mm. Are we fighting? Yo, we gonna see my boy Anjo fight. Oh. Oh, this is cool. Am I like? I think I'm gonna be at the same spot because that would be nice. Yep. Eliminate the warden wave. Babies witnessing war. Eliminate the giant warden. for another round. I just remembered that I haven't approved your marriage application, Johan. Your fiancé is expecting you. Don't you regret being here? Mm. Well, as my mother never failed to remind me, a man should live his life without regret. I think I did. How could I not have come? I rarely get to go berserk. Oh, I never thought I'd see the day you would do that. Well said. I should have approved your application. Back then, but I thought you were a little brat. So what you're saying is, if I can make it back to the college, my application might be granted? I must say, you really always pick the best time to put in a proper request. Don't you? What is this? 
This is my private seal. Use it on your application when you get back and hand it over to the vice chancellor. He will smooth the rest of the procedure. Oh my god, is he planning to sacrifice himself? Johan Chu, hand me that weapon box. Prince for Andre, you extra skill time zero. Oh, it's a cutscene. scared that man that saved the principal was oh. he thought he was gonna be free <laughs> just for him to save him oh, I thought you had already left Tokyo mm. come on stop panting already and tell me who my sons are I seem to remember you had decided to end the bloodline of the Emperor. You must have felt disappointed when you heard the news about your boys, didn't you? Cut it out! He is the current High Patriarch of Hydra, the one you deemed to be an imposter. The two kids are test tube babies. Developed from the DNA sample that you gave to the Germans. Test tube babies? From that minuscule amount of DNA? Are you absolutely sure? I can't guarantee it. But once we get out of this island in one piece, you are more than welcome to run as many DNA tests as you like. Oh, damn it! I've come all this way to see you. Is that all you can tell me? You don't even have a picture of them? Their hidden identities won't allow any photo leak. Are they, uh, good looking? What? That's not the point. You know, I must say they are both extremely attractive. The older one is really quite handsome. And the younger one... Oh, the younger one looks more like a girl, I'd say. Oh, Lord. Are they uh, stubborn? Uh, I think Time and Tize. They are also very stubborn, to the point where they seem unreasonable at times. Now, don't tell me they're nerds. Mm. 
No, no, they are both very smart. Unfortunately, that quality of intelligence has caused them a tremendous amount of human suffering. Are they popular with girls? I'm pretty sure one of them is. Oh, wait. She's a... Sure. Yes, they have many admirers. Though different in style, they are both equally attractive to the ladies. Who knows? Maybe it is true. Does sound like the take after me. <laughs> hello. Yes, hello. I haven't finished yet, but can we please talk about it when we leave this god-awful place? Then let's go. Follow me. damage though. Let me take a breath. Oh jeez. <laughs> Do you need me to carry you on my shoulders, old man? We're in the home stretch. Look at your students. They haven't given up yet. Right. No matter how exhausted you are, you have to summon up your last bit of strength. That's true. You can go ahead. I need to catch my breath. Damn it! I'm here to save you! Please wrap your head around that fact! I'm here to save you! If you kick the bucket, then I've come here for nothing! I am not your boys. Of course I know you're not my son. You're way too old. My sons live in this world, and you're the only one who can save it. The forbidden door has been opened, old friend. We are past the point of no return. I can't think straight. Maybe I just lost too much blood. I need to rest. I need some rest. Okay, now he's just worried about dying at this point. Come on, stand up, you old man. I don't care if you've lost a ton of blood. Listen to me and listen well. All dragon lords were awakened. Much like how the king's blade tried to wake God. Both the lord of bronze and fire and the lord of mountain and earth were awakened. They woke up one right after the other. Someone woke up the Dragon Lord with the sole intention of luring you into battle. What did you say? I can't explain this in detail, but my gut is telling me it's true. From the Lord of Bronze and Fire, to the Lord of Mountain and Earth, to the Light King himself, all these resurrections have been meticulously planned. And all of it leads to the inevitable return of Nidhogg. For all these years, Hydra have been keeping the Light King's secrets at any cost. Because they're afraid that someone will wake it up. Yet every step taken by the King's Blade has been calculated to the extreme. He knows the Light King even better than Hydra. He must have a source of knowledge on the inside. So, who is his source? A human? Or a dragon? But no matter who it is, the Light King's resurrection has been planned 
there is someone working through the King's Blade. The humans are on the verge of confronting the dragons. As soon as we do that, we will surely face utter annihilation. I don't have any time left, but please protect this world for me. My son's still living it. Having thought of the way out. Okay. No, no. Can you use Black Sun one more time? We might still have a shot of success if you could just manage to use Black Sun again. Of course. You haven't seen Black Sun at its most powerful yet. Anju, you are my friend, and I think of you as a brother. But we don't walk the same path. We will not be reunited in the afterlife. I will go to heaven, and you are destined for hell. But I will pray to our Almighty Father that he may forgive you even as you burn in hell. I leave behind a world that will only know even more chaos and strife. Please protect it for me. My son's living it. Please tell them that I am sorry I couldn't be there for their childhood, but I'm happy to know they exist, even if I am now at that point in my journey where I must face its end. Tell them that I love them. Aww. Protect the principal! Fight your way out! Strongest flat son. Come back. Don't you want to meet your sons? I'm so unspeakably happy that they are in this world. I was told that my father waited for me to come to Japan to see him. Even though he didn't make it through that last winter. I think now I know how he must have felt. Cover back. Remember your promise to me. You have to protect this world. Put my sons in it. Oh no. That cutscene went by a little smoother, hopefully. First one was laggy, and I apologize for that. See, if I was still on my all, I would have showed you guys different, but, you know, I go back to school in August. 103? Oh, I'm about to die, bruh. Anyways, I like that. This was kind of an intense battle. I mean,. It was cool, yeah. Anjo fought. Finally got to see the old man stop being a, 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 
pussy. And now, he is willing to sacrifice everything for his two sons. Anyways, this is gonna, this is most definitely gonna take like fucking six, seven weeks. I don't even fucking know anymore. But, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, even though it was kind of trash, but, um, yeah. Also, to see how we're doing, we're, we are at 212 right now. 212 rating. It'll go up higher eventually, but, yeah. Just want to see. And, um, our baby. Alright, she's doing pretty well. Um, uh, I've been taking care of her. And, uh, yeah. Everything's going well so far. So, I just hope you guys who are still playing, I hope you all progress because this is honestly hard to keep up with, but it's going well is what I'm saying. Uh, although it's, it's getting kind of boring to be honest with y'all. Because you're doing the same thing until a whole nother story comes up. And now look, you gotta be level 103. I'm pretty sure the next one's 106, and so on. But, uh, but yeah. That's just how I am doing right now. Um, but like I said before, um, I, did, I don't have enough time to be on my alt anymore because I'm on the verge of going back to school in August, and it's already end of July, so. Um, so I'm focusing on Tomiko right now. Just so that way I could, uh, you know, won't have to worry about being up all night or being tired because I'm worrying about two alts. Um, but yes, um, I go back to school in August. You know, procedures with quarantine is still apply, so I'm probably gonna have to be careful now. But other than that, I've been doing good on this game. And, yeah. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys, you know, hanging in there as much as I am during this quarantine. Keep your family safe. Don't act stupid. Wear your mask, no matter how much you uh, hate it. Stay away from stupid people. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta do this. I gotta, I gotta wave goodbye, I gotta wave goodbye. Say bye. Say bye. Okay. Goodbye.